Greetings, everybody. Johnny T here talking about seatbelt pretensioners and force limiters. I'm late on my assignment again, but I'm on my way to work and I thought, perfect, I'll sit in the car and I'll show you what a seatbelt pretensioner is and what a force limiter means in that process. Send it off to the higher ups at Smart Motors and get credit for my assignment and then move on next, of course, to my Fitness Friday segment, which is coming up tonight on NBC 15. I've still got to write that one too. So we got a lot of work to do today. We got cars to sell. We got segments to write. We got seatbelt pretensioners and force limiters to talk about. What are they? Seatbelt pretensioner. When you jam on that brake, this seatbelt, we're all familiar with that thing where the seatbelt will lock up, okay? That's a different mechanism than a pretensioner. What a pretensioner does is it senses when you jam on that brake, your seatbelt starts to pull back on your entire body to lock you down into the seat so that if that airbag goes off, you are in the exact proper position to benefit as much as possible from that airbag. The force limiter, of course, limits the amount of force so that this thing doesn't just keep tensioning and choke you off and crush you. So it starts to tension down, lock you into the seat. The force limiter limits the force, senses when that thing is tight enough, and then hopefully you, you don't need the airbag, but if the airbag goes off, you're in the right spot. This is Johnny T. Thanks for watching. More information all over this blog and the YouTube channel. The handle still on the YouTube channel is Fitness Nomad because why change it? It's been such a great thing for such a long time. Thanks for watching, everybody. This is Johnny T.